loads more still to come but first we have a winner that's right the first voucher has been won now if you missed it Denny was rather inappropriately holding a carrot carrot whilst chatting with the radio lab guys we'll announce who's won shortly so if you entered it could be you but don't worry if you missed out because there's another chance to win 50 pounds coming up soon now Cinematography is a word you may hear people talking about, but does anyone actually know what it means? Well, I've got a definition right here. It's the making of lighting and camera choices when recording photographic images for the cinema. So, for example, you wouldn't get an artistic close-up of a presenter's lips. That's not working, guys. <laughs> or a strange shot from the viewfinder of a camera just trying to be different. What you would get is a nice clean image of the presenter saying her lines. Here's some student cinematography. My name is uh, Joachim Bergamin. I'm a director of photography, but also I am a lecturer at uh, this university. Cinematography is um, the way you put all the visual information into uh, uh, or register all that visual information into the film, uh, the tape, the videotape or the digital domain. Uh, and it's a combination of uh, good lenses, good cameras, good lighting, good set design, good costume, good makeup. And if all those elements were together, you are well, uh, they, well they work well together, you will have good cinematography. There are a couple of productions which have been interesting. Uh, the theme last term was about uh, picking up a painting and using as an inspiration for a little story. Uh, so the idea is was to either use the you know the composition, color. Uh, lighting of the painting to actually uh, produce a little story uh, with those elements and uh, maybe using the actual painting as part of the story. So the one story was on, I think, Holofernes, uh, the decapitation of Holofernes, I think is, it is. And that uh, was quite interesting. In our group used, uh, I mean, got the painting by Magritte to inspire their story. And, and the way they, they did it was a very clever, uh, um, ingenious uh, story. Um, because obviously it's not exactly about colors or um, uh, composition, uh, it's about the meaning of the painting. And, uh, um, and that's make it interesting. There is a clever little story that obviously is inspired by a, a Magritte painting, and, and I think it worked quite well. Um, 